Welcome back, Legendary Potato here. Today I want to show you guys five ways you can mess with your friend's house in Minecraft. Let's get started. So let's pretend this is a friend's house here. We walk inside, you know, you see a crafting table, some chests, a furnace, and uh, all various stuff that you, you would normally see in a house. You know, you got a bed, got an enchantment table, brewing stand, and an anvil. So, you know, just pretend this is somebody's house, and uh, let's go ahead and do some fun things with them. All right, so number one, when they walk inside their house, let's give them something interesting. So right when you walk in, as you can see, we are stuck inside of cobwebs, and uh, there's no way we can escape unless we have um, a sword and a, an axe handy, uh, which will be a little bit difficult uh, to try to get out of here. And as you can see, this pretty much goes into a pit of nothing. Uh, so it's just pretty funny to watch your friends sink into nothing uh, inside of their own comfortable home. All right, so number two. When we walk inside the house, we're going to be greeted with the little water uh, splashing down on top of us, which doesn't do anything to harm the player, it just kind of messes with them. It's very easy to set up as well, all you need is a pressure plate and some redstone wired up into a dispenser with water inside of it. Very easy to set up and also very harmless to your friend as well. Number three is very similar to number one, although different in its own special way as well. As we walk up to the house here, you can kind of see there is some sand. However, if you hide this in, in a desert or something, it'll be more hidden. However, when we walk onto it, as you can see, uh, we drop into the water pit uh, with obsidian around us. So it kind of traps your friend in here, so they have to find a way out of here, uh, which will be very difficult to either break the obsidian, so they have to hope that they have blocks that they can pile out with. Uh, but I think this is a funny one just to mess with them. To build this, you'll need grass, a flower, some string, and some sand. Right here, we're going to place down double high plant, and then we're going to throw some sand on top with a piece of string. And then over here, we're going to get rid of the plant, and then delete that. And then you can make your pit as much as you want. Just make sure you do not touch the sand, and it will be good to go. So when you walk onto the string, they will fall down right into your pit. You can expand it to make it as big as you want, although it could lack your game if you have too much. Number four, we walk inside our house here. Everything is totally normal when we walk inside, you know. Uh, but let's say we need some food or something. We're hungry. We're low on health. So let's try to find something here. Let's try to open our chest, find some food. And as you can see, we're crushed by a falling anvil, which is using uh, the redstone chest that we had uh, to use the, the trick where you can have chests next to each other. We use that to make an anvil trap, which I think is really nice use of that as well. Kind of a hard one to make, but also useful. Alright, so our last one here is a very, very, very simple concept. All you need to do is take out all the light inside your friend's house so that when it's nighttime, they will be greeted to a nice surprise. Anyways, that's all I have for this video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. Make sure you leave a like if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you're new to the channel so you don't miss awesome content like this every single day. But have a good one and I'll see you guys in the next video.